Queens, midterm season is when we have a tendency to forget about ourselves the most. The arc begins to look as desolate as Nicolas Cage's career prospects, and the lines for Pizza Pizza are out the door and around the corner. Though I always try and keep my sculpted Zeus-like physique, when it comes to crunch time, my kryptonite is the double down. I feel like there should be a waiver you have to sign before you actually order the double down. You know, obnoxious sirens should sound as soon as someone gets to the counter so that they may be warned of the utter stupidity of ordering this sandwich. <laughs> With a modest 1,740 milligrams of sodium, 30 grams of total fat, and 540 calories that are in it, the double down is currently being evaluated by the Canadian government as a potential WMD. My left arm is going numb just thinking about this crazy Widowmaker. And what drives me nuts about this longing for craptacular fast food is the fact that it's processed food that is not good for me. I can eat my grandma's triple chocolate peanut oil fried fudge mocha lace caffeine injected cocaine sprinkled brownies every day for the rest of my life and not gain a pound. <laughs> might be the cocaine. Uh, it might be a bit bad for the old ticker, but hey, at least it's real. After my investigation of the Double Down, I noticed that all other fast food places have equally unhealthier products. These include the McGang Bang, the Typhoon Class Nuclear Sub Sandwich, and the Holy Roman Emperor Whopper. Double Down, you are the Death Star to my Alderaan. You may fire when ready. For destroying the freedom of my health, my heart, and my soul, Double down, you've just been bailed. It's really tasty, though. So that's our show, everyone. Thanks for watching, and uh, I, I feel awful for doing this, but we've run out of time yet again for Mr. Colbert. I, I'm really sorry, Steve. We'll, we'll get you in, I swear. Uh, next time, you know, probably. Good night, everybody. Woo!